familiar, it's lunchtime and dining areas like the underground are swamped with students. That's because more students are staying on campus for their meals. But the convenience of on-campus dining can be a problem for many. I don't want class to one Monday, Wednesday, Friday, so like, I don't really have a time of day where I can come eat, where it's not overly crowded, slash I have to wait for 20 minutes to get food, slash I can find a spot, or it's just like, I don't know. It, it makes it a little more stressful than it should be. Every dining venue is serving 100 more customers on average each day. Students are spending about 50 cents more each visit than they did last year, but that doesn't mean students are always eating more. The other challenge we've got is to try to hold the line on prices because costs have just skyrocketed. You know, everybody knows that fuel, grain, meat, everything's up, and I think we've done a good job of trying to hold the line on that. You know, I think the, the good news is we continue to show improvements in the service. We continue to open up new operations like the Pulse here. And that is just one step KU Dining is taking to accommodate the crowds and their requests. This year, KU Dining spent $8,000 for outdoor seating. It is the third year in a row the underground has expanded its patio. Jacob Musselman, KUJH TV News.